Welcome back, ladies, gentlemen, and everyone that's watching. So, as you can see, day 133, Horde Night, finally. And we are obviously going to do it here in the comfort of our home. Ah, now, it is a shame that I still can't have the lights on. I'm not going to risk it. But we did add spotlights. I actually made an, an, an additional four. So we have eight spotlights downstairs. Hopefully that does not crash. I took the time and took what parts we have. Uh, so it was actually only missing uh, the receiver to max it out. So I ended up maxing that out. And now my hunting rifle and my sniper rifle are the only backup quote-unquote weapons that uh, needs the tender loving care. And hunting rifle, everything is 600 except for the barrel. And as you saw with the uh, sniper rifle, we still need the stock and we still need a barrel. If I'm going to go that route. And then, of course, we I mean, we got the shotguns. Yeah, well, that is what it is. But let's go ahead and grab the ammo we were making. Oh, um, make sure we're prepped and everything. Now, I logged in, obviously, came in, woke up, and uh, had a random horde. And I swear, not even five minutes later, a second random horde came by. So we're actually sitting at 8807 now. I'm not exactly sure what the number is, but uh, it was, <laughs> yeah, a little unexpected. And let's see, how much ammo do we really need? Yes. Yeah, that, that's the right ammo. So we go there. And, of course, we're going to need some 9 mil, which, I mean, we got a shit ton of. So, 1,500 rounds of that, 1,500 rounds of that. Now, the bad thing is, um, as you can see, repair kit situation. Now, I shamefully did use, uh, use the repair kits in here. There was, what, 44? I made 14... Uh, additional one since we had 14 oil and this is what I'm left and of course don't forget we have one repair kit and the mini bike so um yeah situation is getting dire but of course I mean that was to repair some of the parts all that wonderful good stuff and then if we look at our collection of uh, miscellaneous parts right now I mean we got actually quite a bit AK-47 barrels I mean look at that that sells for pretty decent money Let's just go ahead and break that down. And I do need to set up a box separate for uh, flashlights. But, I mean, as you see, I mean, we got some pretty decent parts that if I had enough repair kits, we could combine and all that wonderful good stuff. Oh! That's right. And is that the only... Oh, that's an auger blade. That's a chainsaw. Okay. Because I do remember we did buy a chainsaw blade. So let's combine those. I don't know what I'm going to use a chainsaw for, to be honest. Uh, maybe for shits and giggles. I'll slap together a chainsaw to chop some wood. You know, I, I talk about this coming close to an end, but at the same time, I'm trying to debate if I should or not. Yeah, we have the new port coming out here in literally a couple, a few months. Uh, it's really not going to be long. It's... The time of this recording, it's uh, April 24th, so, you know, July is right around the corner if it is around July when we get the new port. So, yeah, you know, do I attempt to start a new series on this? You know, I'm not really sure because for the simple fact that, you know, you know, I'm definitely going to be playing the new version and seeing how that goes. Uh, we are desperately needing, man. I've never had that little of uh, repair kits. Uh, speaking of which, I mean, we got plenty of liquids. So how are we on? I mean, yeah, we got a decent amount of grain alcohol, but I don't... We really ain't got no blood bags. Or did I miss that? No, we have eight whole, mud, uh, eight whole uh, blood bags. Uh, that's kind of... um. And only 13 anima... Wow! Wow, I have been slacking so hard, haven't I? I mean, even resources. Now, I mean, we're pretty decent on some resources, don't get me wrong. 
No, but yeah, we got a shitload of iron. I did repair the base, thankfully. Uh, and, you know, we got some more iron. We got some smelting behind me. And, of course, I'm making a lot more uh, forged steel. Uh, actually, I'm making 2,000 more in my forges. Well, that's all smelting down. And speaking of that, let's go ahead and grab one more stack. Top off these two. No point in letting this go to waste. And I've been making a shitload more concrete. Because if we do stay... Uh, yeah, all three of them are making 6,000. So yeah, another 18,000 concrete. And like I said, I did fix up the base a little bit. All that good stuff. Uh, let's see. Food and all that is good. We have all our weapons. Everything's loaded. Ooh. Ooh, let's go outside and look at the hotel. Because I don't think we've ever done that. Well, we haven't on Horror Night. I think we've seen it on Horror Night a little bit. I don't think we've ever... And here we go. Yeah. So now I can actually see the results. So as you can see, I put one in each corner. So there's four. It's still dark here, though. Uh, I am tempted to use uh, torches. I was going to make torches, but then I kind of ran out of room. And then in my haste, I just slapped them on the side. Uh, I was going to go ahead and make some plates and put it under there to make it look like it's holding on. Uh, but for functionality is all I'm really concerned of at, at the moment. I don't really give a rat's ass as far as uh, visuals per se. Uh, but yeah, I... I mean, that'll provide enough light. Maybe not out here, which is kind of what I wanted. You know, but, you know, for what it is. You know, let's see. I mean, yeah, for what it is, I mean, it does illuminate it. Now, if I really wanted to get a little bit more fancier, that's where I'd put uh, the spotlights out here. You know, come out with this corner. Because not so much that corner. But come out here to like maybe like around here and then put a you know spotlight facing that way that way you actually have a spotlight really engulfing the uh the corner of every single uh toothy and then for these obviously come out here and i didn't realize that i'm really low like i said on resources um we do have a couple stacks of coal but we only got like three thousand nitrate uh, which is actually very, uh, very bad. Since I can't make a whole lot of gunpowder. Because I was honestly thinking about, oh, you know, some landmines and having all that wonderful good stuff. And I really did want to do have, uh, how can I put it? I really did want to have some landmines set up for the first horde night here. But, you know, that's all right. We got our weapons. We got a toothy. Uh, Mike is guarding my bike at the moment. Hey, Mike. Or, well, I should say Bob. I don't know. Him and his brother look, uh, the same sometimes. And then, let's see. Yeah, I mean, that, that pretty much sums up everything. You know, time went really quick. Of course, I did leave it on 60 minutes up until now. Uh, I really didn't want to spend a whole lot of time... You know, before Horde Night. There was really nothing else to do. And, of course, you know, because of spotlights, it glitches a little bit up here. But, no big deal. I mean, thankfully, as far as the base goes, we are technically done upstairs. You know, all the furniture. I mean, I could... I do need to replace the windows for the skylights. And I do need to put up... I am making 75 candles. Uh, since I can't use modern lights. Or if I decide to break those down and... Try to readjust them. I don't know if I'm going to do that. Uh, I figure at least candles. You know. At least some illumination. Because I really don't like... Yeah, we got flashlights on our head. and But I kind of like that visual aesthetic. So, let's double check. 8807. Not bad. I mean, we were only... Uh, what? 1,193 kills? From uh, a 10k uh, kill count? Considering, uh, we really haven't focused a whole lot on just bashing every single Zed that we come across. It is still on very high spawn, so, um, yeah, you know, 
Not as many kills as you would think per day. But then again, with the forges going and all that, uh, along with the two random hordes, obviously we did have a Samora show up. But she only had one, uh, she only showed up once. Now the question is, which side are they going to come from? And it doesn't really matter since every side is identical, so we are really, really prepped for everything. But that took a, that took a lot of steel uh, to fix all these spikes because they were... Oh, damn, and they're still... I still didn't get that corner. Look at that. I mean... Damn, future girl! Oh, I hear a cop already. Officer? Yeah, you come right up to me. Dumbass. <laughs> oh, oh, good. Because we needed another uh, military vest. Uh, where you at, sir? Wow. You gotta forgive me on uh, aiming. A flashlight. Yeah. Well, really, that's not alright, because we don't need flashlights. Oh, hi, sweetie. Dumbass. There, she. I guess she felt cute. How about you, Sil Sylvia? Nothing? Uh, you were supposed to lose a leg, dude. You didn't get the memo? I'll help you out. Uh, Thick, stop running all over her. That's kind of rude, man. Show some manners. And of course, we don't give a rat's ass about cat food. Uh, no, no. Yeah, yeah, multiplayer, you would have been able to hit me from there. Ow! Leash law. No. And um, hello. There we go. But, I mean, like I was saying, if, if we do continue on this game, uh... I am making all that concrete. And, uh... Yeah. Maybe we'll do that, uh, pit base. You know, for shits and giggles. Y you guys like my spotlights? Mm hmm? Oh. Is there a light ordinance in this show? Damn! That was kind of rude. There you go, Tweaker. With your rotten flesh. <laughs> now, the bad thing is I actually had a man... Oh, I got two sets of man-eater challenges upstairs. And I meant to bring them down, but I mean... It's not like we need them. What are we at? Yeah, 211 points. And I, we are maxed out level anyway. Yeah, so we're not going to get any natural skill points anymore. Since there's no more leveling up, but... Again, I mean, 211 points, and I really don't know what to use them on. That thick? Dude! You were eating that spike! That had a hurt. Uh, get rid of that, get rid of that. Let's get rid of him. Come on, we're in Hub City, guys. You, you gotta be a little bit more active than this. I mean, we got a couple cops already, but... peek a -boo. I swear, cops are rude as fuck. Oh, canine unit. That's what I think about it. I like puppies, but not when they're dead trying to chew on my ass. Or my base. 
Oh, they all got lead weight up their ass. That's that explains why they're slow right now. Nope, nope, nope. Everyone needs to stop crawling over everyone. Get down from there. Sylvia. Damn. All right. Well, like I said, Horse City. Um, you need to calm down. Everyone needs to calm down. Up close and personal with you bastards. Um. Nope, nope. Stick. Take a seat for a second. Oh, we even got some leather. Cool. I gotta remember where the hell I'm at. Oh, good. There's nothing in here. Yeah, we could drop all that crap off. We'll obviously break it down at another time. Uh, but we'll break that down now. Hang on, hang on. Would you guys like to see some nine mil? <laughs> yeah, you jackasses. Come on. Hey, antibiotics. Now we got like what? 13 of them? Well, at least we'll have cops out there though. Oh shit. How the hell did that one miss? Officer? That was a 600 shotgun, I think. Um. Get down from there. Ah, synchronized jackasses, apparently. I would almost be impressed. Dude! No, no, no. Swear to God, man. Crawlers piss me off. Yeah, they magically able to fucking block everything with that damn hand of theirs. Up thick. Oh, you motherfucker. Oh, no. Oh, you fuck off. Yeah, see how... That's why you gotta clean up the bodies quick. Easier said than done sometimes. Dumbass. Should have got the lead out of your ass. Dude, how the bitch? Dick. Nah. Dick, sit your ass down. Gotta get rid of that fucking dog. Sylvia, you got any bandages for me? Nah, well, you're useless then. Mother fucking bitch! Fuck off! Nah, we ain't doing this. 
Motherfucker! Wake the fuck up! Take the fucking hit! Officer? How the fuck am I missing? Ah. You know, when you shoot their leg off and they still run, that's pretty fucking impressive. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Hey, blood bags. Cool, we got 10 of them now. Alright, cops are on force today. That sells my 762. Uh, would it help not to be zoomed in that damn close? Looks like a pretty good uh, trench coat. Or, well, duster. Thick. Damn, dude. Sorry, not sorry. That was some chili. There. Did you all kindly fuck off now? Blood kids, because we need more stuff to sell. Damn! That motherfucker got up. Oh my god, another vest. I can actually just start. Fucker! Oh, motherfuckers! Oh, now it lets me have that option. Oh, what the hell? Open the chest, dude. Oop, I didn't mean to put the ammo in there. Well, nah, we, not like we really need it. 580. Not bad. Now, I'm not even going to try to separate it like I normally do. We'll just we'll just see what the end results are. Um, I just repaired that. Put your fat fucking head up. Thirteen of it. Yay! We gotta. We'll, we'll have some repair kits after this. <laughs> oh, that's that's definitely been the theme of this series is oil. And the sheer determination to find the crap. My God, man. Ooh! Three more oil! That's 16 repair kits! Um, I know you're trying to be sneaky. But I don't really appreciate it. Actually, you know what? Ah, right, you dumbass. Sexy nurse time. Oh, we got... Oh, yeah, that's some good stuff. Some bigger cell, pretty good. And we got some, uh... 
vitamins, so that that'll at least repair our our wellness. A couple more blood bags, that's not a bad thing. And no treasure map. Although I think we do have one set, don't we? I think we did get one set a while back. <laughs> All right, what'd you have? Nothing. Get rid of you. Water, like we need more water. Get rid of you. Clean up these bodies from the corners, because it's literally the last damn thing we need. Holy shit, another... My Amy should have been Karen out of the fucking way. I mean, my Amy should have improved. Uh, if you don't know, I got, you know, arthritis and a wonderful neck narrowing. So it's been affecting my arms and all that wonderful shit for quite a while now. And this past Monday, I finally got the steroid shot, which immediately has been a drastic improvement. Because there's nothing like your uh, chest feeling like it's in a vice grip. But, uh... Yeah, maybe that's why I'm feeling a little bit... A little weird with the uh, controls right now. Because you start getting used to uh, the feel of one way, and then when you, you know... When you heal up and shit. Ooh, black sunglasses. Man, I used to have those all the time. I, that's what I used to rock more than anything. Ow! Ah, ya, ya butt buddy. Bye, buddy. You, you just chill there for a minute. Because we need magnet parts. You know. Sit down, Pick. Dude! I see somebody coming. Well, they were trying to run away, I guess. Did we kill him? Yeah, I guess so. I barely saw him, but that's all I need. Um, uh, Mike? Yeah, you didn't have nothing anyway. Bad puppy? Hey, there's our treasure map. Whoa, 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 whoa. I need you to calm down, good sir. I said calm down. Let me check your foot. No. 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 And I was going to say, watch him be the one to get in. I had that feeling. Is that another cop over there? Holy shit. Oh, shit! I guess I didn't kill him. Oh, he's pissed. Um. That. Yeah, piss on that. Let y'all have your fun for a minute. 
Oh good, magnet parts. Okay. 16 oil, man, would you believe that? Okay. It's definitely a cop board. They got, they got, they don't blow up after they die like that, you know? Holy shit! Officer? Up, oh, officer. Hey, if I clean out your fucking ear, maybe you'll hear me. Oh, there's Sid. Shit. Okay, damn. Whoa, they're picking up. What a pain. Now that's the last motherfucker I need to roll in here. Sit down. Sit down, Smiley. Oh, fuck. This is partly where uh, I'd rather be on the street because no bad puppy shit I'm talking about cleaning up bodies it's like number one rule of toothy because they're gonna start yeah, they're definitely going to start swarming me. I was about to shoot your ass if you wouldn't have fucking did. Die, man. Oh, fuck. Do what I don't care about. Well, um... I'll say, uh, loot with Horde Knight is, uh... definitely a lot more. Although, then again, we are in a toothy, so, I mean, to be fair... Toothy always gives you a lot more loot. Just for the simple fact that, you know, the faster you kill them, obviously, the faster they can keep spawning. And Toothy really gives you that advantage. That's why, for a melee build, for a loot hoarder, if you really rely on loot from the uh, Zeds. Which, I really don't. I mean, that's why Toothy is, like... It's nice, 
but is it needed with the way I play? No. But it does make for a nice up close personal fun on Horde Nights. I, I can't deny that. But as far as the loot, no, nah, it's not like I really give a shit about it. Ooh, a black shirt. That looks real nice. Damn, was that it? That was another one. I'm getting some glasses there. No! Like, damn, she hit me so fucking hard, it knocked the bag out of my ass. It's Sid's obsession with corners. I have yet to understand that. Ooh, hazmat. Nice. Well, you guys are doing some pretty damn good damage to the concrete around here. Not this time, puppy. Fucking sandwiches. Ah, more lead in their ass. Ow! Oh, now your leg breaks finally. I'm here. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, well. We don't need no magnet parts, if I'm being honest, so. Not no big loss. We definitely don't need more military vests, even though... We got like fucking 20 of them now. I'm kind of curious now how many do we really have. Like either... <laughs> oh, shut your hand out. Whoa! Bad puppy! Holy fuck! Gotta stop his ass out there. Oh, a canine unit. Um, hey, buddy. The creepy fucker. <laughs> um, the amount of dukes we're going to make is so fucking ridiculous in this game. I need some of you guys to, like, die out there. Guess you didn't get the memo. Wow! Holy shit, the loot! Wait a sec! Well, we definitely got, uh... More Magnum, uh... More Magnums that we'll be able to put together. That box is almost full. Holy shit. Dude. Oh, 
Fuck off, Steve. Actually, you know what? Oh, now you die. Fucking ass. Okay, I don't know how... I don't know how he died over there. I guess he was hitting the spike after all. Uh, buddy? Okay. How the fuck are you hitting me, motherfucker? And how the fuck you break my fucking leg when I'm fucking crouched? Motherfuckers, man. Seriously, how the fuck you break my leg when I'm crouching and you're not even facing me? We didn't get any fucking, uh... What's it called, did we? Mother... Fucker. Of course, I ain't got no wood. Okay, now you go. All right. Now, 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 pet. Ain't no fucking reason why he is able to break my leg. Fuck off the corner. Unless you're making me fucking money. Fuck off the corner. I said... Get off the corner. We need to repair. We need to desperately repair my weapons. Just in case bad shit happens. Well, more bad shit happens. He's gonna blow. No, oh, okay. He kind of blew not the way I thought he was gonna blow. It's 4 a.m. Woo! Oh, now you come off the corner. Oh, uh, what? You only work nights? That Sid pisses me off. I'm telling you. Come here. Come here. We got over here. 
Another cop? Damn, Adam. Holy shit, there's still a shitload out here. Fuck you think you're sneaking up on, dumbass? Oh no! The final boss. Types two. Got a split for me? No. Hey, <laughs> hey. Not today, fucker. Bobby, give it did some sniping up there, you know? That would have been nice. Okay, so I think we are finally officially done. Whoo hoo hoo. And damn the amount of shit we got. Okay. So, normal reserves and all that wonderful good stuff. You know, a couple things to sell. Two more leather dusters. Pretty damn good hazmat pants. Of course, some good sunglasses. 23 Dukes. Miscellaneous shit. Uh, actually, I went down two wellness? Damn! Alright, um... Two treasure maps, which we really don't really give a shit about. But, you know, miscellaneous crap. Nothing, uh, extreme. Uh, we at least did get a couple, uh... Additional antibiotics and a couple, uh, blood bags, so I guess that's a win. And we're gonna pop pills while we do this. And let's put this here, and of course, weapon-wise. My god. Uh, we actually got so much fucking 9 mil that we have the original 1500 that we started with. And we have a surplus of 256. Uh, between all the damn pistols, as you can see, there's what, 8, 9, 10 pistols. Uh, three sawed-off shotguns and one 600 shotgun. Three military vests, one leg armor. Uh, three more flashlights, which we don't need. And enough for three more magnums. Because that's, you know, what we need. Oh, and um, oil. Because like I did find a little bit more oil, so 39 oil. So, okay, we're uh, back to... Uh, at least some security with, um, repair kits. And as far as kills go, we are now sitting at 9080. Uh, which, if I do remember right, it was 8807 when we started, so that is, uh, 273 kills. Uh, they have done a pretty good damage on the, uh, the blocks here and there. But, of course, I mean, this shit holds up. Concrete, steel spikes, yeah. Unless you never repair the shit. You ain't ever got to worry about them getting through that. But we're going to go ahead and throw those in there just for safety measure. And, uh, yeah. So I got a lot of shit to take upstairs. Get all that situated. Oh, my God. The, uh, I do need to repair my leg. And we did say how many, uh... How many... Let's go ahead and take that up there. Get that started. Uh, yeah, let's see how many, uh, whatchamacallits we have. Military vest. Before we leave. Yeah, I gotta, I still gotta block all this in. I mean, I'm technically not done on the inside all the way. I still need to make vault doors for, uh, I forgot, upstairs. The bar laying around, and we actually, I don't think we have enough bars to actually make it too wide. Which, I mean... The way it sinks in downstairs, I would never really be sniping from up here. So, I mean, I really don't need that to be two bars wide. Oh, and, uh, of course, my tools are in here. Which, I mean, that's fine by me. I kind of want my tools back. So, let me grab this real quick. That way we don't mix it up. Yeah, look at this shit. My God. And that's now two military leg armor we have. So, we now have... Eight. Sixteen! Sixteen military vests! Good God! And I mean, I don't know why I'm hanging out of these. I really don't need a full gear of that. This is shit I'm actually going to sell. 
I think I... I should have military, uh... Military fiber? Not better? But, yeah, I mean... Good God, 16 of these. And, I mean, if you think about it, if I was to actually repair them... Whew, that's, that's a lot of money. But, I mean... They're good for repairs as far as my normal shit. Like, my gloves are damn near wrecked. Uh, my pants are wrecked again. My gloves are wrecked. So, I mean, it's not, you know... Don't really need to sell them. They're, they're good for backup, you know? Okay, so moving forward... Uh, obviously, it's day 134. It's going on 7 in the morning. Uh, I really don't feel like going anywhere today. Um... If I remember right, I think Trader reset it today. I really need to set up my signs like I normally do. Uh, that way I can uh, adjust and know what days is what. Because I always had a Trader Day sign, and then I always had a day for Horde Night. That way I didn't have to sit here and try to do the math if I didn't want to. I could just look at the board. You now, Horde Night's easy. You just add 7 to the last number and change it. So, I mean, day 140 will be the... Uh, the next Horde Night. Uh, and actually, do we even have some signs? We have two signs. And you know what? Where could we put that? I still don't know what I'm going to do with this. Because I, I do need to figure out how we're going to get upstairs to the... I guess we'll just leave it like that. Yeah, because I, since I'm going to go ahead and leave um, that like that... Uh, which kind of sucks because I don't really have a spot for a box for um for concrete. Then I don't know what I'm going to do about that. I got to figure something out. But for the time being, how about we put? Should we put them both centered right there? I'd rather have it on a flat wall, like you know, like where these actually I. Normally, I would have them there, but I was thinking about putting uh, a couple seats right there just to make it look a little flushed out. But you know what? Now, nah, let's go over functionality over anything. There we go. And then, I, me, I don't know if you do the method like this, but I love doing that because then all I got to do is look at it. And, and you know, if I go to a trader and see it is day 134, you know, I just make a mental note and change it when I get back home. That way I know the next time it resets. And then, like, like I said, with Horde Night, because once you get into higher numbers, instead of sitting there trying to figure out, is it day seven, is it day six, just fucking write the number down after Horde Night, and voila. Makes it so much easier. Um, but, of course, that's just me. So, obviously, I am going to leave this here. Uh, we are definitely getting closer now than ever before to our 10K goal. And, like I said, as far as moving forward, I'm really not sure. Uh, we are going to take that and make that into 39... Uh, Repair kits, obviously. I really... If we're going to stick with this this world... Uh, then I do need to focus on doing some resource grinding. Uh, more specifically... Breaking down cars. Getting a stockpile of more oil, hopefully. Uh, maybe another trader run when it resets. If it did reset today. I'm going to have to look back at the last... Uh, last video on... Uh, when we went to the traders. To sell a bunch of stuff. Because I do want to make sure if it reset today, then I need to definitely do it within the next three days. And maybe capitalize on another trader run before the next Horde Night. Uh, that way, I'm guaranteed, you know, I could have two chances of maybe getting some oil from them. And along the way, that would get me out and about to break down cars. I mean, we really never did go out and explore the rest of the map. You know, I don't know what the hell's out here. We actually have a trader all the way out there. I don't even know who that is. Is that the only trader all the way out there, though? Uh, that's kind of looking like it. Oh, we're at the corner of the map down here. Yeah, so... And, oh my god, look at the whole south. Wow! Wait, is that... Is that another trader right there? Oh, there is one down there. Okay, so he's... Man, if I was really... Well, now, if, if if we stayed on the 120 mid days, I would definitely be able to... Uh, in one day, I'd be able to hit all those traders, I think. I would probably have enough, unless that's all wasteland and blocking me. But, I mean, there's the road right there, so... 
that road's got to come down and then split off with a country road some way to that. And then the one all the way out here to the west, I mean, we see the road, we see water, uh, but we see also more of the snow road, which leads from there. I don't know if that would eventually connect to each other. And where was that trader? All the way out here. So yeah, that's that's a hell of a stretch to get all the way out to here. But I'm rambling. Forgive me on that. Um, so yeah, today I'm just going to go ahead, get everything reorganized, and then tomorrow I think we need to pack up and head out. Uh, probably make another trader run. Maybe get some more oil. I don't know. I, I really don't want to say a trader run. I want to I wanna say we need to go actively looking for cars to make more oil. And the traders are just going to happen to be along the way. You know, we got a bunch of stuff to sell. We need to get some of this shit continuously downsizing it. Uh, we still got all those parts in the town up here to the north. You know, as we saw last time. So, I mean, there's there's a shitload of stuff still to sell. Uh, I probably wouldn't repair those parts, though. I'd probably just sell them as is. Because I think I did bring back, like, the Magna parts that would be worth repairing. But the rest of the shit is just that. And we really don't need the Dukes. If you're curious, because if you look in the box, you know, it's like, where's all the Dukes that we made? And if you remember, we have this. So we are currently sitting at 400,000 Dukes in this box and a surplus of almost 10,000 here. Yeah, we're going to be rich. Because that is technically another goal that I want to do. So maybe we will stick with the series longer. I don't know. Maybe I'll throw a poll up. Never know. And just see how to gauge it. But enough of my rambling. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope everything is good. If you're new around here, maybe think about subscribing. If you want to stick around. Uh, don't forget, you know, little notification bell when I upload. I was doing three videos a week. Then I went down to two. And then recently I've been doing only one plus a live stream on Mondays. Uh, that's just because of time constraints and health-wise and all that wonderful good stuff. You know how life is. Uh, so at least I'm consistently doing at least one episode a week. I'm hoping to get a little bit ahead again to where I can go back to having a comfortable space of doing two. And get this going, you know, back to full speed like I was. But then again, I also tend to wonder if it's overkill having hour-long episodes. But, you know, it is what it is. Figure anybody that watches it, they can watch it at their leisure. You ain't got to watch it when it first releases. So, you know, it's there for the liking if you wish. So, obviously, hope everything's good. Stay safe. And until next time, everyone, definitely take it easy.